See in a few minutes. This is so mm. sad. A deer with an arrow stuck in its neck is spotted again in Monrovia. CBS News Christy Fajardo is live in Monrovia to show us more of this disturbing video. Christy. Yeah, Peter and Alsa, we should warn you, the video may be hard to watch, especially for our more sensitive viewers, but game wardens say what's on it is actually a good sign. New video shows an arrow isn't slowing down this deer. He jumps fences, outruns game wardens, moving so quickly they couldn't dart him. It looks like it's in pretty good shape. The arrow is in the neck, but it looks like it may only be in the skin or a little bit in the fat and muscle, but it's not life-threatening at this point. The wounded deer was first spotted in this Monrovia neighborhood on Monday and has been seen several times since. On Friday, we showed you this cell phone video shot by Dave Fernandez of the animal near his house. To see one with an arrow going through its neck is mind-boggling. It's despicable. It's not clear if the buck was shot here in the neighborhood or elsewhere, making it difficult to know if the hunter acted lawfully. For now, Fish and Wildlife plans to monitor the animal. We're going to notify our biologists and let them know to see if they want to come out and see if they can try to immobilize it and maybe remove the arrow. Still in a neighborhood accustomed to living with these gentle creatures, it's upsetting to know the deer will spend at least one more night with an arrow in his neck. I think someone is being a little stupid and reckless. It does look pretty sad. Looks like he could be probably in pain. The deer has been seen scratching at the arrow, but again, otherwise appears to be in good health. He was spotted about 2.30 today on Highland Place, but neighbors tell us they've also seen him here along Alta Vista. Back to you.